Hi, this is John again, and uh, this is my setup with the the ping sensor, the, the servo for the sweep of the ping sensor, the Saeed uh, motor shield version 2.2, and then a motor connected to that uh, for the four tasks that I have, the free RTOS, the, the four free RTOS tasks that I have running uh, with inside the Arduino IDE uh, with the uh, Arduino Uno. So I have an Arduino Uno underneath the Saeed motor shield. And then this is all connected through the breadboard kind of roughly. And I have a 12 volt supply for the motor and then a 5 volt supply for the ping sensor and the servo. And the Uno is still running off USB. So all the power is kind of separate. I have a jumper that's off uh, on this motor shield so it doesn't blow up my Uno with the 12 volts. So right now I'm just holding the reset button and holding the, 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 the motor so it doesn't uh, go running away. So if I let go... The thing will reset and then uh, you see the motors spinning uh, so move my finger you can see the LED that's blinking on the motor shield but that resembles the onboard uh, blinky LED uh, we have the ping sensor that's running as it comes back around you'll see the LED on it blinking indicating that it's scanning and then the servo uh, performing the sweep so if something gets in the way of the ping sensor it stops the motor, it causes it to go to reverse, and then it goes forward. So that's just a basic uh, structure that I have right now. So this is all going to go in the bot. I may or may not have the sweep on the ping sensor. I might have some other, I should have some other like IR sensors, maybe a sharp IR sensor on there as well, uh, like for line following and other things. But it just was something I want to put together and see what was possible with the Uno with free RTOS. So it seemed to be running pretty good on such a small micro. And then uh, it actually does something. So I was actually surprised that it would run on something like that with this many tasks. But I did have an issue, which was odd, because if I compiled the code, if I compiled the code on Linux, then it was larger than it was on Windows. And I'm not quite sure exactly why that is. But uh, if I ran like three tasks on on Linux, it wouldn't fit on the UNU. But with uh, Windows, it fi it fits fine. I tried with semi fours, um, but that was too much of uh, memory overhead, and that did increase the the binary or the dot ino uh, to where it wouldn't fit in the UNU. So that's why I'm not using semi fours or anything like that. Um, I have to explore that later. But there you go. That's just a basic structure of that. And a basic, it's a basic example of running free RTOS on an Uno. Um, there you